Hey folks, how you doing now? In this video, I want to show you how to add and remove what we call testimonial slides. Uh, default, there's four. You can have as many as you want, really. Um, let's just quickly show you how that works. Let's go to our editor and open up our library components testimonial folder, and finally the testimonial slider. Okay, so I'll just put this page back to normal uh, from my other tutorial that I was just working on, and we're going to switch over to code view. And what we've done is we've basically listed each slide with testimonial 1, testimonial 2, 3, and 4. So if you want to add a testimonial, just switch to code view, copy an existing testimonial like so, 4, and paste it below and below and below. And pretty much just where it says do not edit below this line, and uh, of course, um, do not edit above this line. Just make sure you past, paste your new testimonials in between, but not above or below. Okay, as far as the naming convention goes, you can just switch right over to the design view, and then you can, of course, just go ahead and update the heading, the content, the picture, and the link from that point forward. And the same goes for removing uh, slides from the page. You'll see as they, they, we had here originally, they were numbered for us. You know, one, two, three, and four. Uh, just select the slides you, slides you don't need and delete them. You can have as little as well. If you have one slide, it's not really a slider anymore. It's just a testimonial. So if you have two, then it'll actually have some sort of animation function to go between the two.